Hello all and welcome to Soska tutorial. In uh, this section of tutorial, I am going to look at the creation of templates. So for that, I'll first open a drawing which has been previously made here as a sample drawing. So click on this one. Okay. Okay. Now here is the drawing. In this drawing, I have created three blocks. These blocks are, as you can see here, box, circle, and rectangle. Also, I have created three different layers box circle and rectangle i have assigned colors so that you can specify all these three objects separately now let's make a certain changes to this template here so i'll just enter on command lines limits okay and press enter after pressing limits all you need to do is specify the lower left corner of this screen so i'm specifying lower left corner as 0 comma 0 so press enter now the upper right corner which is this one so you can specify the upper right corner as well so let's specify upper right corner as 12 is to 9 whatever the default is accept it enter now we have made an arrangement of this area now let's enter z for zoom and a for all now this drawing setup has been made by us we have got three these three blocks three layers a drawing which is having a length of 12 units and width of 9 units the layout length and width also on this status toggle we have got something like a grid is on so let's turn it off polar snap is on and other things are on so you can just turn it on or off based upon your requirement so just make sure that what are the tools which I have made it on here now let's say that you want to use this arrangement every time you open a new drawing so for that I will save this drawing as a template now go ahead and delete these things the drawing is completely clean it has got nothing on the screen but still it has the three layers and the blocks which you have created now we'll save it so go to this icon the big A icon here click on this select save as and drawing template once you click on this, you are prompted towards the folder, the default virtual folder which has been created in AutoCAD directory in the C drive. You can just search for this folder uh, using the shortcut which is provided in options menu. So we won't look at that right now. So here is the predefined set of uh, template which are saved here. So if you want to save it here, you can go ahead. Otherwise, select your location. Right now I'm selecting desktop. So go to desktop and write my template and press save it will ask you for a description and a measurement unit so if you want to write a description about this template you can go ahead and write it if you want to specify the measurement unit like English or metric metric uh, uh, specifies mm and centimeter and meter convention and English specifies uh, inches and other uh, imperial that type of conventions so you can go ahead and select whatever you like so I'll select metric and press ok your template has been saved on the desktop here with the name of my template now how this template is different from the original drawing which we have created so let's see that thing let's close this window of AutoCAD and also this one now let's go to a new drawing click on new now here we have a set of predefined templates but right now I won't go to this I'll go to desktop and here we have our own template that is my template I'll click on this my template and open once you open this it will load the template which we have saved with the same status toggle options with the same set of layers and obviously with the same set of blocks now you can easily make them you don't to make them every time you open a new drawing this is how you are going to use these templates okay if you want to locate the default location of template directory go to right click and options in options go to files and look for template settings which is here expand it and drawing template file location and here it is this is the default location of templates so where the default templates are saved you can change it by double clicking it and now you can select any location for this default directory so this was all in templates I hope it helped you and if you have any doubt just leave a comment.
on the box that is provided below thank you for watching have a nice day